<laughs> so at this point i just feel like i'm about to commit career suicide <laughs> like yeah you know that that career we never you know we never fly you know i'm about to you know but but, but god did god did you know So the figurine is a supernatural thriller movie. Came out in 2019. Was directed by Kule Afolayon. Also stars Kule Afolayon, Ramsey Noah, Omoni Oboli. It tells a story about this mystical, mythical statue that um, gives seven years of prosperity, followed by seven years of distress to anybody who comes in contact with it. Now, these uh, friends, played by Kula Folayon and Ramsey Noah, during their NYSC three weeks orientation camp, um, get in, come in contact with this statue, and they start to experience things for the first seven years, and it, it, just as the mythology of this statue professes. And it, this movie talks about how they manage this, the things that follow this so this movie came out in 2009 prime Kulea Falayo, at least when it was close to his prime or at his prime this movie has cult followership so please bear with me with all the things i'm going to say now um wait, wait this has nothing to do with it, whether the movie is good or bad what i'm about to say but well, looking at this movie when you look at you know the way they are trying to depict uh rich and wealthy and the way we you know the ballers in nigeria <laughs> When you compare 2009 to 2020, my brother, 2009, they learn where 2020 they and I, I don't know whether it's maybe it's a cooler for lion thing. I'm, I'm trying to find out or remember some of the movies that came out in 2009. But when you compare it, you know, the cars, the, the ladies, you know, how they run their business, when you compare 2009 to 2020, even 2019, ah, it doesn't, ah, 2009, they learn, it doesn't even come close to how the depiction of wealth you know is really shown I, i'm just saying I, it was just what, what i was thinking when i was watching this movie now um i don't know how high um the figurine comes in when it comes to the best movies in nigeria yes we all know it has a cult followership we all know it, it, it won a lot of awards but to be honest i just felt like this movie, or maybe it was because of my expectation, but I just feel like this movie left me hanging a lot while I was watching this movie. There were just a number of things that struck me as being odd, and it had to do with screenplay slash dialogue, had to do with the actors, also had to do with the editing. Now, um, I, bear with me. Like, in, you know, the actors in this movie are well versed you know in, right now they are veterans in in nollywood but i just felt like with the exception of maybe omoni oboli you know i just felt like many of the actors in this movie did not bring their a game it's just my opinion it's just my opinion while it, it, it just felt dull you know watching kula afolayo I, I don't know as i was watching him my brain was just processing watching his brother gabriel you know same movie same role same life my brain was just processing him doing it better i don't know I, it, it it's just the way i saw this movie like i said many of, i just felt that many of them didn't really bring their a game screenplay too wasn't really on point for me i just felt like there were a number of scenes that could have been maybe 10 to 15 seconds longer you know I, and that has to also to do in addition to to the to the editing of this movie there is sometimes some scenes just stopped abruptly like that i was like ah why, why were they running this movie the way it was you know it, it's just the way i felt as i was watching this movie yes the end of the movie they, they throw us a, a curveball which is really cool you know finding out everything that happened but then again that opened up the movie to a one or two plot holes that to me i just felt like ah this movie just gets a cbo you know it it's not it's not a bad movie but i, I don't know watching it i just felt like is this the movie that won all those awards it, it's right now on netflix you can watch it again if you want to and i just felt like in the end uh it didn't really for me oh, for me it didn't really live up to the expectation of the figurine as i've always been hearing all these years but for you that have seen this movie what did you think about it whatever your thoughts comment below let us know yes there's no 
<laughs> there's no rating for this movie. Maybe I need to watch it again so maybe I can make up a better, I don't know, analysis or whatever of it, you know, so I can talk about it better. But for you that have seen the movie, like I said, what are your thoughts? Comment below, let us know. Please like and subscribe. And please, in this COVID-19 uh, situation that we are in right now, do something good for anybody today. Peace.